there are still a lot of questions that I had uh, from the level one course. So level two seemed like an obvious choice for me. It's been uh, years since the level one. I took the first one ever. Uh, and it was awesome back then, and now the level two is even better. It's constantly evolving, and that's what I love about it. The level one uh, was a lot of like sort of how to be a coach, not just giving somebody exercises and, and letting them do their thing, but actually coaching them through it and giving them something a little bit more. This one takes you into the art of coaching. Uh, it's a lot more strength focus, you know, speed work. In the level two, we cover the speed training philosophy, the strength training philosophy. We cover different evaluations and assessments, as well as we go much deeper into how to coach and how to actually execute the Training for Warriors session. I took the level two because I wanted to learn more. I wanted to get into more of the running mechanics, which we got into today. What is agility? If you can't define something, then you probably can't train it into someone. I was worried at first that it was gonna be, you know, much more intense, but we learned a lot. He really took the time to explain everything to us and make sure we understood why we're here and what our purpose is. The animals can be used as an upper body warm up as well. Strength training, what I say, made simple. We're gonna be doing some abductor work. Sprinting and the Training for Warriors system. It gets people into a mindset that maybe they haven't really tapped into yet. Everything has a purpose, everything has a reason, and it, as long as you're pushing and driving towards that reason, that purpose every single time, you can only get better. We had different warm-ups this time. We had different warm-ups this time than my first level two, and you know, it just keeps evolving. The biomechanics of running, how to coach the running, how to use the different agilities within the system, how to use the strength training. We didn't go deep into the science. We didn't go you know, deep into the anatomy and physiology. He gives you the basics. He gives you a good understanding of it all. And it's kind of a, a good education all the way around. First and most importantly is safety and not hurting anyone. It's okay to work hard, but work hard and smart. I think it's safe. I think the way that he goes through the system, it's, it can be done with anyone. And I plan on doing it with everybody, every one of my clients. You know what's the first step, what's the second step. It's organized where you're gonna not get hurt and you're gonna see more gains this way. Any ability, any age, um, I'm gonna be 50 next month, so I was a little intimidated about coming, thinking that I was gonna be um, not prepared enough to be here. I did okay. <laughs> I know a lot of coaches that could benefit from this course tremendously. Uh, I, I can't think of one person that I would not recommend this to. I plan on getting back and completely revamping how I offer the program in my facility. There's just so much more to the program that I didn't even realize that I could be offering and, and now I have those tools and I have those paints as Martin put it. He just thinks about everything, you know, from planning out your workout to your recovery to your nutrition, he covers all the bases. I think there's like no way you could fail. It's a great course. I can't say enough good things about it. I'm really excited to go back on Monday and start teaching it with my clients and get them fired up the way I am this weekend. If you want to influence somebody, take the course. If you want to be a coach, take the course. It's worth every penny that you spend to take this course, definitely. Oh!